<sighs> We're struggling. Get any kind of run going. Yeah, we have chocolate bunnies. That's the, I would say, the vast majority of our Easter chocolate is chocolate bunnies. Yeah, they're probably zero of them are vegan friendly. But I only like like 90% cacao dark chocolate. That's all I eat chocolate wise. I eat gross chocolate. I don't like sugar. Yell at me firmly to do something. That's that motivation you need. Uh, I've been vegan for like 10 years, I think, Timrod. Almost 10. I'd have to check. I don't remember. It's been so long. Should I let Homie back? Oh, yeah. Let Homie Thruster back. Poor Homie Thruster. Just abandoned out there. Dark charcoal, earthy taste. Yeah, that's my kind of chocolate. Love that kind of chocolate. Vegan gang. Oh, nice, Poro. Hello, vegans. We have a couple vegans in chat now. I draw them in. They get lured here by my smell. And trust me, it's smelly. Oh, I can't afford him. Rusting homies out in the wild, out in the cold, just thrusted homies. Yeah, I don't eat fish either. Uh, yeah, beans. Uh, protein adds up surprisingly high too when you eat as much food as I do. Like, most of y'all know, I eat a disgusting amount of food. Like, a lot more food than the average human. Um, and it just kind of adds up. I mean, if you're eating like five potatoes, you're getting like 10 grams of protein out of just potatoes. Yeah, grains too. What's the reason for being vegan? Uh, originally started literally for uh, bodybuilding. I saw a bunch of bodybuilders at the time who were like the craziest physiques I had ever seen. And they were all vegan. Uh, and it's just really easy to be leaner vegan. You tend to hold on to less fats. It's okay if I only eat potato. Yeah, for sure. I understand how much you eat. Yeah, I eat a disgusting amount of food. Yeah, I know a lot of people eat that way, Spookiest. Live off potato, I'm a personal trainer, lives in Florida, said so. Exactly. Yeah, no no animal products is how I how I eat. Uh, we probably lose here. I don't really have any scoring help.
pretty likely loss incoming here. Does ingesting other people's bodily fluids count as not being vegan? My stance on it is that it is not a product of animal suffering, typically. Well, depending on what kind of fluid we're talking about, but... What point does it stop becoming cannibalism? Oh, I'm all for cannibalism. Don't get me started on cannibalism, 9-3. Humans can consent. Yeah, exactly. Why did you instantly pin that message? Why is that the pinned message now? Ooh. That doesn't really help me right now, but that would be such a cool card to have. But I need to do this one so I can actually not lose here. Oh, it's a good joker again. Yeah, that pin was instant. Ugh. Recommended spot to fur fluffs mum. Oh, man, that's hard. You're missing the herb. Try, I was trying to read merm and I read mum and then I read flurfs. There's no R. Can't spell merm without an R. This is such a fun one. Fluff's merm. There we go. <laughs> no worries. Live and enjoy the lurk. Thanks for hanging. It's going to be a large hand. Fast forward through the smut to yell at people. Oh, people like when you come in here to yell at them. You eat dirt? I like I like a good handful of dirt here and there. Could go for some dirt on a hot summer day. did get the, uh, what I was going for there. A high card should make it through. Oh, hi, Mindset! I missed you, Mindset. I didn't see you in there. Bird is right up there with calluses. Oh, uh, what are we buying here? Maybe an extra hand. Sucked me it again. That's how it goes here. Walking's good. Nah, I, fighting top. Fighting top tier. What is that trash? I don't want that trash. One diamond. One diamond. It's all I need. One. One. <laughs> Scarlet.
<sighs> what support, KG? What support was that? Yes, we can play a flush and then go for the diamond flush. It would do quite well for us. We need to make more queens and kings too if we can. I think queens are going to be better for us if possible. Uh, this should immediately just win right here because of the times three. Just the queen in the hand. Yeah. He's real this time. I am mad. Hello. Oh, there's so many good options in here. Yeah, we can make it through right now, though. We're okay. <sighs> Honestly, I could probably just get by on a high card right now. Yeah, watch this. Ready? That makes it through. Easy. You know when you add time to the timer? Yeah. Well, y'all add the time to the timer. I'm just here. I just work here. Can you do the opposite? <laughs> sure, I got you. Doing my part to lengthen Fluffmas. Doing my part to lengthen Fluffmas. I think Fluffmas that's below the threshold, though. I'm gonna roll the wheel. No wheel. Yeah, I think 50 is the threshold. This is going to help us a lot get through some blinds. Going to miss the extra income, but... No repeat hand types. Yikes. That is what my entire build is based off of. Did clear it. A little scary though. A little scary. Didn't like that one. <sighs> Extra stinky? Oh yeah. That's almost every day in the gym for me though, honestly. I'm just made of stink. Um, we can pretty much just survive off of high cards. We just need to pull another queen if we can. Uh, I'm going to discard one more time. Did not find it. We are going to make this into a queen. Uh, we put the queen before the kings. We play one, two high card. Doesn't really matter what we play. We'll play a six high card. And then an ace high card should get us the rest of the way through. Might actually be able to set up a high card build here. I've been wanting to do that for a while. Last card would be nice to have. 
Absolutely. Okay. Um, I think Diamond's out. Leave Diamond is out. Mime is in. <sighs> We're not trying to play the Queens right now. He's specifically looking for, uh, kind of any enhanced is good here. I mean, I think we'll make it to, uh, anti-8 pretty well on this deck already. No reason to play diamonds anymore point we're just looking for queens and kings to fill out the deck doesn't really matter what high card we play but i would like to have a decent one to hold on to um, we're probably not going to get two diamond flushes here so i'm going to discard all of these with a play here going to discard again. Might honestly just make it through, because it's going to times three here. Yeah, we're fine. Complete every deck in stake. Yeah. So we've already unlocked every single deck in the game, and we beat every deck on white stake and red stake, and we beat checkered deck on orange stake last night, which was huge. Orange checkered run was insane. This is perfect for what we want. Nice. King and queen out of that. Um, today, I'm just kind of trying to pop off with the anaglyph deck on just a simple white stake and maybe go for like the 100k hand. Really like to get that. <sighs> and I think this might be the first uh, chance we've had at getting a good one. Play only one hand. That's probably how we lose. That is probably how we lose. So we do have to play a flush here. Um, I have the most clubs, but I have diamonds out on the board. We do have a glass card we get to play. We might make it. It is unlikely, but we might survive. Okay. The retrigger held in hand saved us there. Ooh, absolutely. Can we survive without ice cream? I think we can. Uh, this is exactly what we need. This is exactly what we need to make this deck go crazy. Ooh, we landed the holographic too. Okay. All right. We're in a good place now, boys. We have a good shot at this. DNA was a big unlock there. Another glass card. Diamonds is good if we just want higher chances of flushes. Queens, please? Yeah, a re-trigger queen, too. Huge. Huge. And we now have five negative jokers coming in at the next shop. We're saving it for negatives. Good night, Obi Thruster. Okay, I am copying the retrigger queen. This is exactly what I want here. That will also get us a high card played on the board.
Ready? Y'all want to see this pop off? Um, really does not matter what I play here. Let me convert these to diamonds. I just do want more diamonds in the deck. All right, ready? This is going to go crazy. Ready? Oh, I forgot I have to order the queens before the kings. I had them in the wrong order there, and it still did really well. But I do have to remember I have to order them down the bottom. Okay. A negative money earner. Plus free money. Plus free money. Yeah, we're going to be running a high card strat here. More high card. That's exactly what I wanted. Queens or kings. King. And it's a diamonds. Reroll. Uh, yes, we can get pretty crazy with Vampire. Not going to help, but more of these could be good. And start making our first steel cards. All right. Playing a high card sets money to zero. Sick. Uh, I don't have to play high card, necessarily. I can play pairs. No reason for me to go for diamonds anymore, honestly. Okay. Do I want to lose $40? Not particularly. Uh, however, I don't think we make it through the blind without playing high card. Need money. Yeah. I have to play the pair of queens. Only option here is pair of queens. Yeah, negative to the moon is great to have. Uh, so, I think we want to make our kings steal. Because they're going to be hitting when the multipliers happen. Um... I'm going to play... I have to play the pair of... Oh, I can't use DNA this hand because I can't play a high card. Yeah, I can't play high card. So I got to play that. And then I have to find another pair. But I can't play a high card when I do it. So I need to see the most likely second pair I can find here. I only have one ace, I only have one nine. I have two tens remaining. I still have the most queens and kings remaining. So we are going, how many jacks? I do have jacks too. So we're gonna play that. Cause I can't play a high card. Okay, and if I can play another pit, there it is. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. I am gonna glass card this king just to be safe, but uh, we should be okay now. Nice, okay. Woo, survived, easy. Look at all the interest. <laughs> The money is insane. Okay, more tarot cards would be great to start manipulating the deck more. Uh, I like Vampire, but he might not be sticking around. We will see. Don't really care about those. Let's see if we can find more kings and queens. Yes, more queens. I want all kings and queens and start to duplicate the enhanced kings and queens. I will take more tarot cards. Um, that is nice to have in the deck. Okay. Uh, negative based on money with our income is actually pretty good. All face cards become gold cards when played. That's going to be pretty cool to utilize right now. 
Uh, we don't want that permanently. We don't want to like overwrite ones that we already have stuff, but having more golds would be nice. Also, having a uh, retrigger on all held in hand abilities. Very cool. Also help to feed vampire, yeah. Um, boot should go before all of our multipliers. I'm gonna put all of our multipliers next to each other. We're probably never gonna have a straight, but we can... Yeah, it doesn't matter where straight is. <sighs> Vampire eat first, then gold. Yeah, he, he's over here still. That's pretty cool. Yeah, we actually have a good chance for this to kind of go crazy. Okay, we want to just discard. Uh, we do want to keep a face card in hand if we can. Even if it's not a king or queen. Okay, if I play a single high card here, I can copy a queen or king. I would ideally like to find a better one first to copy. Didn't find a better one, but we can just copy a king. Yeah, kings are better for us to copy right now. Okay, then. And, uh... I'll play one get rid of stuff hand. We also got to feed that glass card to vampire, so he's getting stronger. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we'll have to get rid of Vampire eventually. But, uh, he's very helpful right now. More money? $44? Okay, then. Spectral Pack, maybe get to duplicate some. Purple Seal destroys five random. I don't want it to hit my Queen or King, but thinning the deck here to potentially get rid of things that aren't the Queens or Kings is very good. <laughs> of course it took the Queen and the King, but... It did take others, too. I think that was worth the risk. Not really going to be using these. This could be a good run. Oh, it'll peel the gold and then re-gold them? Not super useful, but I'll take him. Uh, stuff to feed... Yeah, stuff to feed to Vampire. Okay. Um. What am I going to copy here? do one initial discard here. Okay. I'm just gonna copy the king again. I know he's just a normal king right now, but uh, we will just copy him as is. That gets our one high card played. Um, I guess we could... Bonus both of these. And lucky this guy. Discard. Let's play this first. Hopefully this doesn't finish it. I don't think it will because we're not hitting our times three. Cool. I didn't want to end that one yet. Okay, $49. Very glad we held out for that. Uh, face card we can turn into gold. Okay, I'm actually going to play the pair of queens to make gold ones. I could play the four of a kind queen, and we probably... Oh no, we won't get the double. I'm just going to play the pair.
Okay, that was a way higher score than I expected. I wasn't sure how much we needed, and I knew I had to play a hand type that I had already played. Uh, I wasn't sure that it was going to go that far overboard, but it did. $175. More gold cards we can make. Copy cards, very good. Three hands and 3k needed. Uh, I'm not going to take any of those. Boot going crazy. Oh, yeah. You're so right. Boot is insane right now. Another king? Another $49? <laughs> we have a steel card or a copy card. We're making plenty of gold cards. I'd rather make a steel, copy it, DNA it. Yeah, I think making vampire as good as we can here. No reason not to do some rerolls with this money. Yeah, that's going to be pretty good to have. What are you replacing? We can level that up so fast. Um. Hmm. Four hundred gold for achieve. Yeah, I think we will this run. DNA we are keeping right now to make our deck better. Retrigger held in hand is holding the run together, and we need the queen and king. The rest of these are negatives. I think we actually get rid of card sharp. I think the queen one is going to be pretty good for us. You're right, it is only flat. Yeah, you got a point. Yeah, I think you're right. Build it around kings more so than the queens now. It's nice to have the molt from queens, but more molt times is smarter. And we have way more kings already. Minus to the left of king. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean, yeah. We'll think about it before. Play only one hand type is fine. Okay, we're going to try to duplicate a steel king here. Perfect. I am going to make you into a steel card. I'm going to duplicate you with DNA. I'm going to make another one of you. I'm going to discard for another tarot. I'm going to make you a lucky card. Well, let's, let's discard again. Okay, I'm going to make you a lucky card to feed you. And then if I'm only playing one hand type, I can play all three of these as a high card to turn them all into gold. And then if I put gold in front of vampire, right? It'll make all of them gold before. I know it's kind of a waste with the king, but. Crazy. Oh, the wild too, yeah. This is this might be a run, boys. We might be onto something here. Hand size is great. Wow. Hand size is such a level up with this. <sighs> no. Best joker now would be every card is face card. Yeah, that could be kind of cool. Although I think this only applies to kings specifically, not face cards. I think I did test that once. Another $50. Ooh, juggler would be nice too, but I don't have room for him. Another $50. The money is crazy. 
Oh, gold every card. Yeah, I see what you mean. Um, can be used just to feed to vampire. Another twenty dollars. Destroy two would be very good for thinning out the deck. Ooh, the copy. Yeah, you're out. Copy is in. We go next round. Okay, we need to find our Steel King. We need to destroy anything and everything we can that is not Kings. For now, we keep some of the Queens. There is a Steel King. We are going to copy you. Oh, I didn't even have time to death him. We one-shotted it before even triggering Card Sharp. Wow. This is this is a run, man. This is a run. Wow. Okay. I'll level up flush. I don't think we're gonna use it. Another twenty dollars. Um, we really want taros here. Might not be worth copying. Remove steel from original copy after it's made. Oh, it does, doesn't it? Remove steel, but copy is a steel. Yeah, so we keep the same amount of steel. I'd rather not be losing steel, though. I think as good as Vampire is... I don't know. He'll still level up. He'll still level up plenty. Keep same number steel, but you have bonus. Yeah. But if we make more steals, we level up by 0.25. But he levels up by 0.2. It's only a little bit different percentage. Increase rank, we can turn some of our queens into kings. Okay. So, yeah, if we copy steel. Oh, we can do this, though. We'll make another steel here. Um, we copy this steel. Which, all that does is feed the steel to Vampire, but makes us another king. Turns him gold and then steals the gold. Also scales when you play non-steel kings. Okay, we're one-shotting before we even have a chance. I need to discard more. I'm not even having a chance to try anything. Didn't give me the high card, really. I thought we had telescope. Mask behind vamp gonna be better. Easy with an enhancement rather than a blank. Yeah, I agree. Would be cool, not useful with the current setup. Worth to see if we get a uh, high card. Yeah, use this to copy something. Okay. Flips and sh uh, shuffles all jokers. I think that's going to be okay. I don't think we're going to have a huge issue with that right now. Uh, we might, honestly. I know that's DNA. <sighs> um, I guess just copy. Well, let me see. Strength the two queens. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. <laughs> like a what there? Like a what? copy him okay we're gonna copy the steel one so we still keep a steel in the deck and then we get the multiplus from him I 
think we're gonna try to endless this one. I just have a feeling this might have some potential. $400 achievement, let's go! Huge, huge. <sighs> Gotta reorder the jokers. Yeah, you're right. Um, okay, DNA does not matter where he is. He's our front one. Molt from bootstraps. Um, Retriggers. Retriggers probably all the way at the front is a good idea. He's also molt. Um, those are molt multipliers. We're going to put you after vampire. You are a money one. You don't really matter. Okay. <sighs> we could do minus one ante. Um, just to make it... I mean, it's not like we're really going to have trouble one-shotting right now, but more shops for ten dollars that's three more shops without having to worry at all yeah copy a king from another card i'd actually take that over the fifty dollars right now just more of those is great and then I'm also going to be able to do that again. Make another death card. Increase rank. How many queens do we have left? We still have six queens that we want to turn into kings. Which is actually pretty good for us. Fifty more dollars. Red seal. Yeah, if we find that again. Another fifty dollars. <laughs> uh, okay. One more roll here. Three more negatives. Four more negatives. Okay, then. Four negative jokers coming in. Um, maybe just convert a queen to a king. I'd like to convert it to a steel king, if I can. Try to save two queens here. Try to find a steel king. Strength queens, death non-queen. I was trying to find a steel king to copy the other things into. Um, okay. So we can increase rank of two of our queens here. Yeah, no, I agree. I think if we just play a five-card hand of enhanced cards here to feed the vampire, it's a very good idea. Um, I don't want to lose my death convert here, though. I do have four queens, though. Yeah, we're gonna make we're gonna make four queens into kings. Did I click the wrong one? What did I do? I think I clicked the wrong one. Uh, okay. I'm gonna play... Death? It was a death card? You had strength and a death? Oh, okay. I'm not really concerned with it. Whatever happens, happens not up to me. You need to copy more kings? Yeah, obviously I was trying to copy the kings. <laughs> what do you think I was trying to do? <laughs> Useless. Useful. You aren't first-hand playing a full house? Do you have any idea why I just played the full house? Do you have any idea why I was playing the full house, though? 
Like, I agree, copying kings is good. I didn't have one of the good kings that I wanted to copy, though. And it would have one-shotted the round before I got a chance to level up Vampire three times. Yeah, scaling Vampire a full 1x off of one hand right there. From 3.6 to 4.6, that's massive. Kind of useless, you'll go away. You're handy if we, for some reason, have a discard left. I mean, I want to have as many jokers as I can. Yeah, it's, it's a big, big vampire scale. Six to seven, better to scale kings, yeah. But as much vampire scaling as we can do early is definitely good for us. More money. Okay. One random joker disabled. Not a great one to have disabled, but we will play one. Okay, we are going to turn this queen into this king. Ah, uh, queens. Might as well turn other things in first, right? Get just other garbage out of the deck first. Um, we will copy a Steel King so we don't lose the Steel King. We will probably one-shot even without Mime. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we can always strength them, yeah. Wipe out the other cards. That was good. This guy's up to a 2.75 now. And all that's before Card Shark's even hitting. Destroy is great for us right now. Please give me more high card level ups. Times three per steel card on hand. Yeah, because we have Mime. Well, Mime didn't even do the retriggers that time. Don't buy playing card voucher. No, I'm not buying that. More steel cards on the kings. Fantastic. Honestly, I didn't even look at anything else, but that was the right choice. We're kind of removing cards at this point. Plus, I don't have any room. Um, I can't get rid of any of my non-negatives right now. You're adding cards with DNA. Does that count? I don't know if that counts. More steel cards. Yeah. It does count? That's pretty cool. But we can't afford to replace Mime. We can't afford to replace Baron or Steel Joker or Card Sharp. The only one that is kind of replaceable is Card Sharp because he doesn't scale. He can't get bigger. Baron is kind of getting bigger by having more kings. Steel is scaling. Vamp is scaling. Card Sharp is the most limited multiplier right now. Destroy two. Yeah, card sharp only goes off on the second hand. We're not even making it to the second hands, though. Got the 100 mil! 140 mil! Two massive jokers unlocked this run. Woo! That would be a ton of money. We don't need more money. We're fine. We're fine. It'd just be cool. Get some high card upgrades now. Technically can buy the shop. Yeah, I'm really looking to just upgrade the uh, 
80 chips and 50,000 molt. Yeah, I have no upgrades. Yes. We, we need high card upgrades desperately. <sighs> yeah. There's one. Oh, that's a pair. Destroy two. Pluto is what I think will let us beat Anti-9. Yeah, we need Plutos. Double money and another steel card. Yeah, the problem is none of my regulars are replaceable. Yeah, but the we don't really need this from the boot right now, honestly. And the boot's negative anyway. But we don't really have anything replaceable. There's nothing we could get here that is worth um, something here. Yeah, a blueprint. Blueprint's the only thing we could find that I'd instantly take. But they can contain negatives, so they are worth checking with this amount of money. We unlocked Brainstorm. I don't have Brainstorm yet, no. <sighs> okay. We're going to make you into a steel card. We are going to destroy two cards. Ones that are further from a king, just in case we get more strength cards. We're going to play you, copy you, and then do that thing to you. And we will probably already beat this before I have any chance to do anything else. Yeah, honestly, at this point, we're not making it to Card Sharp. We need to replace Card Sharp. And, you know what I just realized? Juggler is better than Card Sharp, or it's the same. It's two times 1.5s if we have one more card in our hand, but it plays on the first hand instead of the second. Juggler is just as good as Card Sharp. You want Card Sharp deeper in the run? You think so? One extra king does the same thing as card sharp, though. Yeah, I guess what... Yeah, that is a good point. Once we're no longer winning on one hand, that is nice to have. Another strength card is good. Things apply before any other mole. Okay, true, true. I'm gonna take the fifty dollars. Five hundred twenty-three dollars, man. I think card sharps replaced. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think card sharps replaced. We have eight uncommon jokers. How much more is DNA doing? Uh, that is a good point. What is DNA doing for us at this point? We don't need more kings. Did that just to spite chat? It is a very good point. At this point, we just want to lower our amount of overall cards. Still need base molt for the X molt to be insane. Yeah, that's just going to come from high card level ups. But we also do have uh, two molt for every $5 from bootstraps, which is disgusting. That's so much. Uh, yeah, I actually think we dropped DNA. There's no reason for us to keep duplicating that king. I agree. Uh, you did say put him at the front. I do remember he's kind of wonky, so it is good to have him there. Oh, it's so good, Banna. Uh, I'm nowhere near 100% yet, but uh, it's a great game.
You have enough cards. Yeah, destroying non-kings is much better. I agree. Yeah, if you like any games, that's another flat times two. But I think the times three from Card Shark does have more potential. Ooh. Ooh. Um, he will continue growing. He's not going to be better than Mime. He's not better than Baron. He's not better than Steel. And he's not better than Card Sharp, though. Juggler is good. Oh, that's a discard. Never mind. I thought it was Juggler. Um, yeah, let's just go to the next. Uh, we want to keep a queen if we can. There's our other queen. We can finally make it a re-trigger king. That is fantastic. If we can start getting uh, re-trigger steel kings, that is ideal for us. If we turn that into a steel king and we make more of him, we are golden. That's what we want. Uh, it does not matter what high card I play. I could just play a gold king because he's going to get vampired and then turned gold again. So we level up a little bit. I could play three kings to get more gold um, and level up vamp more. I don't want to lose steals, uh, but any of these that I can play, honestly, just five of them to make five golds. Yeah. Because every time I have gold kings to play, we get to level up vampire more. Three hundred seventy-five million. That's pretty huge. That's that's a big hand right there. How many queens do I have left? I have two remaining queens. Please give me high card upgrades. Those are not high card upgrades. That was using five of your multipliers. Yeah, true. <sighs> Please give me Pluto. Where is Pluto? Uh, yeah, that's a good voucher to have. Don't want to add cards. Steel cards, bubbles money. Swapping anything to steel is good because it adds to steel joker. Uh, fool card is good. High card, let's go. Use you to duplicate something. It's only the played card. It's not held in hand. We already have retrigger held in hand. Okay, we go next. Uh, can't discard you yet. Make the king a steal. Honestly, I should save this until I see the seal king. We need the seal king. Um, oh, I can make another steal, though, with the fool. And that way I can get this tarot card out of here. I want to make him a, a steal really badly. I uh, won't be able to use that. All right. This runs crazy. I could have played some other stuff to give more enhancements. I forgot. I got to try to keep leveling up Vampire. Pff, 
8.2 bill. Wow. Wow. <laughs> well, and Steel is leveling up Steel Joker, too. 8 billion. 8 billion, boys. I think we're, uh, we have a run going. I think we have a little bit of a run going here. Wow. Tom, is this better than UFC today? Have we surpassed UFC again? Malt is like 85 mil. What just went extinct? There's no UFC on T's. If UFC was on. That's a flat times three, but it is not a times three after. He's an uncommons. Yeah, card sharp's gone. It's driver's license now. This is a times three that we don't have to wait for. It's already there. Card sharp is now gone. It is a minus 1.5 from baseball, but it hits at a better time than baseball. Baseball hits at a weird time. I trust my logic on that one. Destroy two. Has power. Does have power. He is scalable. We could probably use 30 planet cards pretty soon. And driver's license is not scalable. Can you hit negative jokers in the normal shop reroll? Yes. Yeah, you can. I'm not going to take him. We might see him again. <laughs> okay, boys. All righty then. The question is, what are we copying? What are we copying and when? Baseball card is really good, but he does trigger weird. Um, because we have to sell something here. So we have to sell either baseball or driver's license. Obviously, we have to keep mime and we have to keep Baron. We're keeping steel. Uh, vampire is at a times 5.6. You think sell drivers? Yeah, I think by the end of whatever this guy does, he is really good. Baseball's getting you lit. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to copy vampire then. For an extra 5.6. You don't think I copy Vampire. Oh, copy Retrigger. Yeah. Yeah, Retrigger is going to happen the most. That's a good point. Oh, what did I just hit? I hit something with wheel. I don't know what I hit, though. Oh, I foiled the baseball card. Honestly, we don't have chips. We need chips. That was good for us. Highest X Molt should be blueprinted. Yeah, and at the end of the day, our retrigger is the highest X Molt. Okay, we are fishing for our Red Seal King. Uh, I am going to also destroy two more useless cards. Okay, we did not find him. Do I farm vampire more? Do I play the five of a kind and farm vampire? I think I go vampire, yeah. I mean, we easily destroy this, so I think we farm vampire here. Oh, play five golds. New joker, three jokers unlocked this run. Yeah, we're not worried about score yet. Yeah, we just got 2.6 billion. 
with getting rid of five of our kings. I think we're going to be all right. Planet X. There it is. Four jokers unlocked. <laughs> wow. We're kind of popping off on this run. What's your highest score? Eight point something billion that we got like a second ago. Blast destroy two. Yes. Keep thinning out the deck to get only kings. Um, convert is very good, especially if I hit that red seal. I'm going to hold out and try to find the red seal to convert something into it. Still no red seal. Okay. Uh, I'm going to just make you into another steel king then. Yeah, I was looking for the Red Seal King. I was going to make him a steel card and then duplicate him. Uh, we play three of a kind here. We might not make... No, we still make it through here. We only have three kings, but I think we still make it through here pretty easily. One point nine bill with only three kings in hand. That's pretty crazy. We also have three blind copies again. If we find a uh, even cheaper rerolls, amazing. Uh, if we find another negative tag, we're in really good shape. High card, please. Give me high card. <sighs> yeah, I want red seal king. Red Seal Steel Kings is what we're going for, ideally. Any chance to find uh, what we're looking for here? That is another retrigger. That's pretty cool. Um, I think we go destroy two again. Thinning out this deck is, like, kind of goal number one here. We're in the billions. I'm not worried about millions at the moment. Still can't find the red seal. I'm not making him until I find him. We're thinning, don't you worry. We hit E's! We're on E! <laughs> Let's go! Oh, that's so exciting. My first E hand. $50? Increase rank. Do I have any queens left? I do have two queens. I think I'd rather have a better card than this, though. We'll buy it, but we might sell it. Oh, we hit ease. That's so hype, man. Uh, I'm going to level Planet X again just because it's cool looking. It's not what I want. I, I really need Telescope. Another $50. $20. Ooh. Fool is better. Aaron, stop! Yo! One E2 bits for the first E. <laughs> One E2 bits for the first E. Thank you, Infinitium. I appreciate you. Hopefully, we don't get to, uh... If you're matching E's minus 11, this could get really dangerous for your wallet, Infinitium. This could get really dangerous for your wallet.
One E three, but who's counting? Yeah, fool is really good. <sighs> okay, give me the red seal king. It is all I want to find. There it is. There it is. We now have a red seal king. Being able to duplicate this is the most powerful thing we have in the game now. I'm not worried about score at all right now. I know with three kings, we're still in the billions. We're in the E's, even with only, even with five kings down there. I'm not sure. This could go, this could go all the way, healer. We will see. Destroy two. Very good for us right now. Real fortune. Played gold cards earn $3 when score. If we had joker slots, that'd be fun. Anti-38 win. That is... We really just want deaths and hangmans right now. I have what I want. Yo, Venom will come in. Anti-38 win. We're gonna see... Oh no, this blind is 28 mil. How are we gonna get past the 28 mil blind? There he is. There he is. Look at him. Look at him. We have two of him now. Oh, he's beautiful. <sighs> I think one E11 is a hundred billion. Uh, I'm going to discard this guy and hope to find... Yeah. Uh, I'll wait for a better destroy, too. Nah, we want to go down to just, just kings anyway. Anything not kings at this point, we want out of here. Um, Discard one, see what we get. Perfect. I'm not worried about score. Uh, I'm just going to play. Oh, I don't want to lose Steel Kings. We can't play Steel Kings because Vampire will eat them. Don't you worry, 9-3. I'm paying attention. Don't you worry. This is going to be our highest scoring hand we've done yet. We are about to break our record. E13. E13. <sighs> okay. Yes. New Joker slot on the way. 10 trillion. Crazy. Couple of tarot packs is really good here. Destroy two. Yeah. Every destroy two we get is really good. Did I hear you say you were almost done? Nah. You're blowing the slot machine. We're not even close to done, Merm. We're just getting warmed up. Uh, yeah, I can destroy four cards. We are going to uh, destroy four cards here. Check this out. We have to wait till next hand, but... Destroy and dupe is all we need now, yeah. Uh, plus one hand size is probably the most buff we could find. Wouldn't mind if we're landing a couple Wheel of Fortunes, too. Baron is better. Please trust. It's hard to explain. You think copying Baron is better than copying Mime? Each king held in hand gives 1x molt or retrigger all card held in hand abilities. Give me the science on it. I trust you, but I want some science. Wheel can only hit steel and blueprint. Yeah, I think so. <sighs> I 
I would like to have fool. I, I need more hand space. You got what you need? I was looking for uh, high card upgrades. I really want to find high card upgrades. All good. I appreciate everybody's advice here. I might yell at y'all a little bit, but I actually do appreciate any input on this. Not being mine is 1.5 per king and 1.5 per steel. Yeah. That sounds right to me. <sighs> Dang. I was looking for my, uh, my good boy to copy. I mean, I guess more steals. Oh, let's get rid of this queen. We seen any more negatives? No, as soon as we see another negative. Red seal and mime multiplied by barons. You want to balance baron balances better. E to the 12. We did have less cards. I played three. Uh, as soon as I find negatives again, though, we're, we're launching the, the quad negative skip. He'd be really handy if I had room for him. Multipliers at 16 bill. Wow. Highest was E to the 13. Totally put speed down to one for a hand. That'd be fun. I'd be down. I think you have a few flat molt cards in those negatives applying after your big X. Um, I think just straights. I'll check though. This is just chips. This is just chips. This is money. This is Midas. This is for a straight, but we never play straights. Um, trying to watch, but yeah. Better by 8x, you would get 8x more score if you copy Baron, just test it. I mean, we could test it, you're not wrong. I'm down to test it. Those are all molts, and then the, or times molts, and these are regular molts before it. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're fine. Uh, we do have this now, which is crazy. Check this out. And ready? We also drop in speed to one. We now have three of those bad boys. Um, okay. I mean, we, we have the ability to test it. But no matter what... Yeah, the, the blueprint in front of Mime has to be re-triggering steals. Whereas the blueprint in front of Baron is not going to re-trigger the steals. And the king is a held in hand ability, so we're hitting the baron every time we re-trigger mime and we're hitting the steel. Yeah, it's way better to copy mime. Mime is giving us baron and steel. If blueprint was on baron, we're only re-triggering baron, not steel. Thirteen, new record. If there was a safe way for me to test it, we could test it, but your malt was too E to the 11. <sighs> malt, bonus, glass. Death. Please give me a high card. Should we excel this to prove someone wrong? <laughs> Is this a YouTube clipperoni? Oh, I'll upload this whole playthrough to YouTube. Uh, I uploaded a long play yesterday. I'll just drop another one of these. This is crazy. This is the kind of long plays that the people need.
negative tag. Yeah. You know what we could do, though? How PMAX said that we could, uh... Uh, we could get the boss line reroll from getting all those vouchers. Mime, Red Seal, and... Or voucher. Yeah, vouchers could be good. Mime, Red Seal, and Blueprint multiplied by Baron. Three times one, you want to make that two times two by copying Baron. I, I don't think that's correct here. I'm trying to find a way that that could be correct, and it just does not make sense. Pull for anti-level reached? I don't know, Venom. I don't know where we're getting to here. Yeah. Duping Baron and Mime. You, you gotta dupe the one that's duping the already duped. Like, this is multiplying something that's happening more times. Um, we just go for a record hand here. This is going to be my biggest hand I've ever done. Yeah, this is going to be our record hand by far. You ready for it? It's going to be pretty wild. I don't even know what to predict on this one. E16. Top of hand, red seal. How many left in deck? Next round check? Yeah, I got you, Ricochet. E16. Do we test for up healer with a perma ban on the line? <laughs> I think I'd rather just not test it. I mean, we could try, but Fluff hates speed one. You gotta remind me close, closer to it. I forget. Oh, that's so good. 20 quadrillion. Uh, here's what the deck's looking like right now. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 non-kings remaining. This was two minutes ago. It's got to be like, like in the moment, you know? No way to test unless you have the same hand set up. Yeah, I mean, if we do get the same hand we had last time. Oh, we are duping this retrigger steal like crazy. You win either way. I do win either way. If we can try to copy the same exact hand we had last time, but it's got to be the same number of steels, same number of red steel kings. That's the only way for us to truly test it. This is, this is nuts. 89% correct means like 89 hour ban. Crank speed down, but you can also crank speed down now. Y you are correct, you are correct here. We'll try a, we'll try a 1x. 1x game speed, just to watch how long it takes. Um, all right, wow, that's slow. Is this the same as last hand? 
The online calc is saying what you're saying, but I'm 93% sure the calculator isn't working. That'll be fooling only deaths for your red seals. Yeah, I think you're right. I think you're two red seals off. Yeah, it's going to be kind of hard to test. I mean, we will blast past this hand. I'm willing to just slide it over once. Like, we're going to annihilate this hand anyway. He might be right. He might be right. No, he's he's entirely correct. We have to give him mod, man. He's he's completely correct. He's right. He is right. I'm sorry, healer, you're correct. You are correct. I see what he was saying. It was really hard to explain. Basically, we were getting three re-triggers with him in front of Mime. Now we're getting four re-triggers. I will- well played, well played. Listen, healer, you're correct. <laughs> that, that is on us for not believing you. You are incredibly correct right there. Yo, what up, uh, Bri? How we doing? I was- yeah, honestly, I respect the hustle. Very, very well played, healer. I am sorry we doubted you. Oh, kind of disappointed in auto speed up. Oh yeah, it does auto speed. I knew it did that though. Okay. Oh. Okay. We could copy blueprint. Oh, it's a random joker. It's a random joker. Never mind. I was excited. Yeah, I forgot it was a random. I thought you got to pick. I thought it was like copy to the right of it or something. Banana. One in three chance though, totally worth. That's like 935 chance. Super worth. Clearly we know how to math in this channel. I, I, I'm I proud of Healer. Healer stuck to his guns. He knew. He knew what was correct. We're gonna break a thousand cash. He like dropped the mic on us. He really did. Duping Joker might have been better than baseball. That's what I'm saying. But uh, baseball is going pretty hard. It's hard to see what exactly he's doing, but baseball is going hard. The fact that we're still only at 75 chips at our base level here. E15. This is a wild run, boys. Okay. Spectral could kind of pop off, could also ruin our life. Add a red seal. I think I will add a red seal. Never thought about controlling the order of vampire and gold mask. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You just put them after vampire. Our vampire is up to a times 11, by the way. That's uh, pretty up there. It hits the dupe on mine, blueprint, baron, steel, it's better than baseball. Yeah. Uh, 
Ba-da-dum, ba-da-dum, bum. Two hour YouTube vid incoming? Yeah, for real. I will drop this one though. I'll upload this run. This is a fun run. Fool card and death card is exactly what we want here. We are good for the next round. Check deck for cards left. Pretty few remaining. He did. He had it all figured out. Man stuck to his guns. I'm so proud of Healer right now. <sighs> okay. This one is going to be a hanged man. We are going to discard one to try... We're going to discard all three of these to try to get these kind of cards. Uh, you are going to be made into a re-trigger. We are going to dupe that and we're going to convert another gold to this. This should be our record hand. E16? This might break E16. This could be an E17. Yeah, eventually we will be removing steals. E17! New E unlocked. Yes. All the way, yes. Huge. Almost in the quintillions. Yeah, we're kinda we're kinda up there on the number right now. This is hype. Steel card. Um, yeah, I'll just make you into another steel. Absolutely Giga Chad run. Oh yeah. I'd been waiting for one of these runs. I knew we had to be getting close. We've played so much of the game now. He would get strong, but... Please give me Pluto's. Banana. We did see the banana. I know. Oh, we hit something. What did we hit? Blueprint. Plus 10 molt. I mean, by the time all the rest of this hits, it's something. I might take the voucher reroll, honestly. I think we take the voucher reroll here. I vote voucher. Yeah, I don't think we need more jokers. We need safety from vouchers. Um, do I destroy a gold king? How many voucher in shop? B is good. Probably don't destroy a gold king. Voucher reroll gonna give you negative slot. Oh, you're right. Yeah. I'm gonna get the antimatter. Don't destroy kings. So we're thinking discard these and hope to get. Mm hmm. Do I just destroy this 110? Feels kind of bad to just waste the, the hanged man on one card. Do I discard again and try for it? Discard some steel. True. Regular steels that aren't the retrigger steels. We'll do a five card discard here. There we go. That was worth. Is six voucher better than six negative jokers? 
I think so. Because we'll get a non-negative Joker slot from Antimatter. Uh, we'll also get unlimited boss blind rerolls, which I think that alone is worth. How many kings? Don't worry about it, Reiner. I'm saving the fool for copying red seals at this point. Oh yeah, plus hand size too, yeah. Plus hand size, plus hands played. Okay, we're only clearing the E by three right now. Yeah, we need... Oh yeah, we could get telescope too. Telescope would be a game changer, honestly. Pluto! Hi, Pluto. You want death cards? I actually think I'm getting rid of steel here, and I'm gonna try to get a second death or a second fool. Fool Pluto. Oh, you're right. I should have done that. Remind me next time. Second tarot of card you're holding. You still can. What do you mean? Oh, can't get a second tarot. Can't get a tarot pulled. Oh, I see what you're saying. Okay. I see what you mean. Yeah, let's just do this then. We're going to skip voucher shop here. I'm just going to get every voucher in the game. Perfect roll here. Look at that. Unfortunately, we are going to have to de-steal a king. We don't have a gold king to play. So we do have to de-steal a king here, but it's all right. We'll always have to do that once. Zero discards. Maybe sell Midas? It's more of the vampire that's the issue. I'd rather make him gold than make him nothing. E17s. <sighs> oh, I thought it was blueprint again. Yo, look at the vouchers. Okay, hold on. I gotta take off the Udi. I'm hot. <sighs> All right. Let's lock in, boys. Let's lock in. <sighs> I'm hot. Scroll off the voucher. I want a screen cap. That's some vouchers right there. Honestly, that right there could be in the thumbnail. <laughs> That's a wild picture. Wasn't hot, just wanted to flex. FML knows me too well. Okay, interest cap means we can get $20 a round per interest. Plus one joker slot is massive, and I think we just take hand size for now. Hand size is actually a huge buff with this. Spectral cards may appear in Arcana packs. Thank you for the follow, Erdish. What is it, Edrich? I'm locked into this deck you're playing. This is a fun deck. Yours is just running on the side. Unlimited boss rolls is very good for us. That's very important. Planet cards appearing more often. Can I get a telescope? Please let me get telescope. I still didn't get telescope. Minus one anti is good. Do I care about losing a discard? I don't think so. I think minus one anti to let us roll through more stuff before the antis keep getting bigger. I had already bought the blank vertical. You have to buy it to get antimatter. Minus one discard at this point is fine. Yeah. Another voucher chance for minus one anti is big. Um, I'm not buying the playing cards one. I don't want that cluttering up my shop. Healer said do it, so we got it. Yeah, at this point, what Healer says goes.
It can be enhanced, yeah. Wait, what am I waiting on, Pmax? Buy Joker for Chip? Uh, oh, yeah, you're kind of right. Hollow? Maybe not him? I could find a bigger Chip Joker, probably. Sell if you find better Joker, yeah. One hand size right now is still crazy. Because that's way more times molts. But, uh, you are right. There is merit to getting that. Please give me a Pluto. Give me a Pluto! Yeah, bowl would be crazy. I did pass a wheel. Probably should have grabbed wheel. <laughs> oh, that's only played cards. That actually wouldn't be that big. Yeah, I'm going to stop ripping through my money. This would be cool if we had spades. Honestly, if we had spade kings, this would go hard right now. This would be like a 5x to our score. What's the third joker? Uh, it's a negative, so it doesn't matter. But it's retrigger two threes, fours, and fives. Oh, uh, there's our negatives, too. We could get two more negatives by skipping that one. We'll probably do that. Okay, hear me out. Hear me out. Skip twice, and I get three negatives. Yeah, I think three negatives. The chance of getting something crazy out of another negative is really good for us. Um, How many clubs am I relying on? Honestly, let's play through the club debuff. I'd like to play through it. That way, if I see the diamond debuff and I roll past the diamond debuff, I know we're not going to roll right into a club debuff. And we can survive a club debuff, I believe, if we just discard right. What do you think? Am I crazy? I have unlimited boss rerolls, though, so maybe we just roll past it. I do have infinite rerolls, yeah. Keep club. Wouldn't stress it. Maybe we play... Let's try to play through club. We can play through club. <sighs> yeah, we were fine. With all these red seals now, my goodness, man. The red seals are going crazy. Okay, we're still hitting E17s. We're higher E17 now, though. We're at 3.5 instead of a 1.2. We're gonna need something to pop off a little bit harder. 40 interest per round. forgot about the negatives useless not useless that's actually a good one uh this would mess up my deck i'm not buying that this was really good though that's actually really good crank screen shape to max and speed to four i doubt we're gonna find a spectral that's good but we'll check The screen shake to Max would be very funny. <sighs> I'm gonna sell you, we're gonna sell you. Uh, and we are gonna roll a Wheel of Fortune. I would have preferred foil, honestly. I actually prefer foil. Do I have anything else I can hit? Steel? Yeah, I can hit steel. Another molt. I need foil. I need chips, man. Nobody's giving me chips. <sighs> yes. 
Yes. Let's get telescope. I really need telescope. I don't know how we haven't hit telescope. We have how many vouchers? Look at this. How do we not have telescope? <laughs> Old tarot's you don't want to show up and reroll, get more chance of seeing the tarot's you want. Yeah, that's a good idea. Just hold one there so we don't see him. Yeah, death we do want. Uh, fool we also want. Cool. Nice. Fifty dollars. Fool Pluto. Uh, I just use temperance. You were right, though. That would have been good. Ooh. We could lose here. We're getting... We're getting close to the edge of this not working anymore. Um, we are going to death you. We are going to full death. Um... I honestly don't care about this tarot card anymore. I'd like to get that out of my deck. All right. That is the hand. Let's see how it does. You have four hands. Actually, should I discard for red seals? I should discard for red seals. Debuffs all played cards. Okay. I should debuff or roll for red seals. I think so, you're fine. I'm not worried about not having steals. Yeah, that was much better. I prefer this. Yeah, that's much better. I do have four hands to clear, yeah. But only two debuff cards for the next one is really nice, too. This should be our record hand. Maybe E18. I don't know if it's going to quite make it to 18. E20! Wow. Okay. Please let me find telescope. Any way to level up what I'm looking for here. Please give me some two Plutos. Two Plutos, please. Just give me Plutos. At this point, I have pair leveled up so much. Banana. <laughs> E20, 20 best I've seen. This is this is a run, man. I'm having a great time. Pluto! That 10 chips is like a whole E level on its own. I'm going to do what 9-3 said and just buy these to take them out of the reroll pool. Yeah, I think fooling and death. That's a really big money increase or that we take that. We take bull. What does that do to our run? Right now, we only have 95 high card. So this is the equivalent of how much of a 2x? Uh, 1284 divided by 95. This is a 13x multiplier to our score right now. That is a 13x mult. Losing one hand size is big, but this is a 13x score multiplier. Yeah, it is a little scary, though. It is something to consider. There is our death card. Pluto. Oh, I almost missed the Pluto. Good call. I did almost miss Pluto. Uh, I'll stop rerolling at $10. How many cards do we have left to destroy? One. It's not worth anymore. We can just death that card if we find it. Really, all we want is fools and deaths now. 
Thank you for the follow, uh, Samuel. Twitch plays Pokemon, Twitch plays Belatro. <sighs> okay. Um, I am going to sell you. I don't need you. Uh, gonna do a full discard on this. Nice. I'm going to make another Steel King with the red retrigger. And I'm going to play you. Yeah, we can do one more discard. I might not get something that I want, though. This is fine. Let's see how big the score is now. With Bull, honestly, we I think we just made a big difference. I think we're like E21 at least. I don't think I have as many retriggers this time, though. Maybe E21. I don't know. Bull was a pretty big upgrade. Bull should be massive, right? E19. Wow. E19. I must have just had less retriggers overall because of uh, hand size and not having as many red seals. I would have expected more from Bull, yeah. And down two red seals, okay. Come on, Pluto. Like, I'll keep buying stuff, but... Yeah, spending gold would be... Spending less gold could be useful, but we can get more out of our gold by spending it. What chips were hurting us there? Yeah, we might pick up hand size again if we find them, honestly. I mean, plus 1,400 chips should be giant. We'll have to compare to that last rando, or the last big run, and see if maybe it is, uh, we just had so many less red seals. Because mathematically, the chips have to be helping a lot, right? ships is less than taking your multiplier and molting it by 1.5. Yeah, you might be right. Anybody feel like really checking the math on it if you're really bored? <sighs> yeah, is it, is it healer math time? Pluto! On it. Well done, healer. Yeah, figure out if 1,400 chips is better than a plus one hand size with a 4x re-triggered Steel King. You're on the assignment. Pluto! Finally lucking into some Plutos. I used to pull them out of the reroll pool. Another hermit. Hermit's keeping us above seven hundred dollars, like nonstop. Fifty dollars. We're profiting now from rerolls. Another twenty dollars. <laughs> We're making money actively by rerolling. There's a full card. Ideally, we would get a uh, death card now. Another $50. <laughs> we are upping our money by the second. By holding three here, we are increasing our chances of seeing the money ones. Rolls cost 14. Yeah, but we started at 700. Vampire is up to times 12. Yeah, I'll stop rerolling here. They are getting expensive. We profited overall from that, though. <sighs> um, dang, we don't have a death card right now.
Baron is giving 6x molt in that case, 4 times 1.5. I think as long as you're over 250 chips without bull, you're ahead with one hand size. I mean, the card is Red Steel King. I don't how to explain it, but the chips added makes sense as how much X chips it was before based on how much X molt you're losing out on. Yeah, so I said it was what? is it, At the time, it was 95. Oh, it was 13X. Whereas right now, I'm doing 1.5 times 1.5 times 1.5 times 1.5, which is only 5X. Maybe I have the math wrong on that. One hand size is better. Okay, so if we find Juggler again, which is pretty likely, we buy him again. It was worth a shot. It seemed like the right move. Um, do you think I'm good here, or should I check again for another uh, red seal? Yeah, that was the right play. Rather not minus steel kings, too. Thank you for the follow, uh, Samsonite and George. Or Troubadour. Is Troubadour even more hand size? Yeah, we don't have anything we want to use here, right? Yeah, okay. Vampires eat seals. They don't eat the seals. The seals are too fatty for them, yeah. Oh. Plus two hand size, minus one hand per round. Oh, Troubadour would be ideal, yeah. Okay, we're still hitting E19s. We did also just get a bunch of uh, high card level ups too, compared to what we had. So that losing the chips will hurt less. Uh, permanently gain plus one hand. Yeah, especially good if we get Troubadour. Long form content and also just shorts of your hands going off. Yeah, I agree. We're just farming the YouTube content right now. Plus one hand size is better than 2K chips. Yeah, exactly, Poro. Pongs. Okay, Plutos are great for us right now. Plutos are huge. Just took this to look at five at the same time. I'll take my free fifty dollars. Full Pluto. Oh yeah, you're ah. I, I always read a message the second I've already done. <laughs> I've already done it. Five shorts of this was the time I got E10. This was the time I got E11. Yeah. Hermit and Temperance. Little $70 shop roll right there. Um, We could Wheel of Fortune Bull, but we're intending to sell Bull, so... That's our only Wheel of Fortunable one left. E10 sounds like those chessboard moves. Yeah, eaten. E10 eaten. <sighs> we only have one card to destroy. It's not even worth. Buff your Wheel of Fortune purchases stat. This is true, yeah. Death. There we go. That's what I was saving out for. Perfect. More red seals. It's two red seal copies. Uh, Pluto. We're not going to fool Pluto. We're going to... Death is still the best thing we can fool. But it is nice to have another Pluto there. This is going to be... This is going to be close now. We're actually at the point this is going to be close. The very large blind wasn't that much larger, but it is something to consider. One E twenty one to five point five E twenty one. True, but the difference between one E21 and 5E21. I mean, I guess they're still like right at the same threshold, right? I guess it is 5X, but scientific notation math gets weird. Would you look at that? 
Here's the only thing I don't like about this. We are losing this steel card when I play it because of Vampire. It'll still be our highest hand played, but we do have to keep that in mind that we are destroying it every time we do that. You have a death, though. Yeah, like, we'll be able to make him again. This should be our highest plan, though. This should be our record. Oh, yeah, and Chariot, too, because it doesn't remove the red seal. Yeah, that's a good point. This has got to be a 22. I'm giving this one an E22. Still just... Wow, we didn't one-shot it. Wow! We might not even two-shot it. No, because we're going to get the same exact score. We're going to get 8.06. Wait, did that not... Did that just barely go up? I don't know. We make it, yeah. We actually really do need that hand size, yeah. We might have to sit at the next shop and re-roll until we get a hand size. Yeah, I think we don't make it past the next blind without hand size. Well, we make it past one more, but we don't make it past the next ante. Yeah, we did just lose three steel cards, too, which did affect our overall multiplier. Okay, we touched 21. We all thought Bull was going to be a game changer, though. Every one of us thought Bull was 6xing our score. <sighs> um, we do have a 5 of a kind, but it's not going to even come close to losing out on those extra cards. At this point, high card is by far the best we can play. Nothing will beat the amount of kings in our hand, which we just found out the hard way. Oh, please let me crack a thousand. I want to see a thousand. There's a fool. There it is. One thousand. Woo! That's big. That's crazy. So many small things you can throw out. Yeah, exactly. All thumbnail worthy. We're going up in money. We're rapidly increasing our money looking for this. Does not matter. There's no fortune cards we could take here that are good for us other than Temperance and Hermit. No reason to, because the only thing it can wheel is the bull, and we're about to sell the bull. A wheel used stats. Yeah. We're still above the money we started at in the shop right now. We're not losing money at the moment. We're gaining money. We're still gaining money. We started under a thousand. We're getting close to losing money now. It should be possible to, for us to... What is the next blind right now? 1.29. Yeah, we don't make it without hand size. We literally have to have it. 
I mean, if we play four times with all red seals, we make it. But that's a lot to ask. Exactly a thousand for the thumbnail. We might go higher. If we make it further, we'll, we'll beat it. Yeah, I think we have to keep re-rolling. The final ante if memory serves. Is it actually? Right now, we can beat this if we play four hands. We cannot beat this. Actually, we're just on the edge of it. We score about 4e to the 20 per play right now. Play to limit reroll cost, then go nuts on rerolls. I think you're right, yeah, because our reroll cost is getting too expensive now. List goes to 16, but it keeps going. Reroll, yeah. One. See, the problem is we're losing boat, boot molt here, too, which does get multiplied by a lot. I don't think we go below 900. We can just barely survive this, I believe. But uh, I think we do have to have all red seal steals here. I think we make it through in four. That's not promising. I have two copies. Okay. All right. We're good. We death you. Oh, we're not good. Chariot the gold. You are not good. Yeah, I am not good. Oh, yeah. Chariot the gold. Yeah, yeah. You're right. You're right. I see what you meant. Yeah. Oh, there is still one missing. Oh. I don't think we clear. Yeah. Uh, just been playing a crazy long hand, George. That's where it's all coming from. We do miss one retrigger here. Play them both. Yeah, I'm playing just one. I agree. We lose a steel card from our multiplier every time, but we gain almost the same from vampire. Wow, that was a big difference on score. Oof. Okay, we have all steel, all seals now. We might not clear it. Oh yeah, I'll do the next one at four. That's a good idea. This is crazy. If we make it to the next shop, we make it, we make it. We're fine. Oh, I forgot to four exit. One max screen shape speed four. Yes, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. I'm thinking about it, I'm remembering it, I'm gonna do it. We don't clear it here, so. Vampire is getting slightly stronger every time we play a card. So he is doing something. He will forget. No, no, I, I remembered. Look at this. Settings. Screen shake 100. Game speed 4. <laughs> We're zooming now. We're going. That is shaky. That is very shaky. We cleared it with one hand to spare. Okay.
Okay. All right. Double money. Screen shake is way too much. Oh, yeah, it is. Polychrome. It's not going to be... I mean... Do we swap Bull for Polychrome at the moment? No, he's still not worth a Polychrome. Just trying to figure out what to do here. Got a full card, that's good. Another Chariot, that's also good. We did de-steal a couple cards that round. They're all gold red seals now. Got a Pluto. Plutz! It does sound like that, Timrod. I feel like I know the sound you're talking about. There's our death card. Okay. We have our perfect hand set up again here for Taros. We're just looking for Plutos and hand size. Hand size! Hand size! Okay. Okay. That was big. That was big. That does help. I don't think it's a full carry, but it is helpful. Yeah, if we can find Troubadour... Um, I'm gonna reroll down to 900 coins to look for Troubadour. But, uh, this does get us through the next ante. We will finish this boss blind, at least. What do we have coming up? 5.1. I might re-roll, too, to get away from very large. And every Pluto we find along the way is great. <sighs> you have unlimited re-roll? Yeah. Plus three hand size. I don't think we could go up to plus three. Maybe we could. Maybe we could replace baseball with plus three. No, we're still getting more uncommons out of him than... Uh, extra kings, I think. Not sure. Somebody would have to do the math. Yeah, if we got two more, each one of those is four 1.5s. So we're at eight 1.5s. Do we have eight uncommons? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have seven uncommons. So a plus two hand size would be better than baseball. Is campfire not crazy? Might have been. I didn't think about it. Campfire was crazy. I don't even know what Campfire does. Oh, yeah, we should be wheeling now. You're right. This is not... If this was held in hands, that's easy, but it's, it's just face cards. Udo? Troubadour, I believe. Campfire, every time you sell something, you get times one. That'd be pretty hard to farm right now when we only have one Joker slot. I think we stop above 800 here. Oh, even Taros. Oh, yeah. That would be good. Yeah, we could just sit here and roll and sell taros forever. Well, now we know. Perfect. Oil on Juggler was actually very good. Campfire reset every boss blind. Yeah, but we have enough money we could just infinite buy taros and level it up every time and get it to where it's worth more than a hand size. Okay, we're gonna go in now. Reroll. Forces one card to always be selected. 
That doesn't hurt us too badly, does it? I mean, we have infinite rerolls. We can just go for like a debuff on and brick you. I don't really think it can, but it does limit our ability to use these though. Check which ones you can roll into. How? Collection blinds. Oh, it's only going to be one of these five. Lips and shuffles. No, can't it be a bunch of different ones? Or does it have to be one of these five? Sell a joker? Oh yeah, we have plenty of jokers that we're not using at all. This is big, big. Okay. Yeah, that's free. We have like six jokers here that we're not using. This guy. We've never once used this guy. Okay. You are a red seal that I can chariot. Since we turned you into a gold card. Uh, I am going to do a full discard of these five. Perfect. And then we are going to death you. We are going to fool the death. And we are good to go. I think we, we one-shot this one. Yeah, 2.4 to the 21. Let's go. Massive, massive. Hand size is the key. We actually have to find Troubadour if we want to continue winning this. That was also a good find right there. Um, this is $4 to check multiple to get our full death chariot combo. No benefit to that more money is 18 max i don't believe there's a limit a wall would have been two full hands it would have yeah two perfect hands um i can't actually use oh i yeah i can chariot him i would do that in the actual round anyway so it's called endless mode i believe it does cap at a certain point I think there is a spot that it does end. Another chance to see a Pluto. Caps at whatever the integer overflow is. Just got in my nap stasis. What is that pin? <laughs> Don't worry about the pinned message. Uh, there's no reason for us to level up flushes or straights. Rather have the money for rerolls. Two randoms. There's fool. Cool. We almost have our perfect combo. There is money. Yeah, I know there's a point that it, it ends. Because I saw on a Belaytra University video, he hit the cap. Man, if we had hearts, if our build was based on hearts, this would be a game changer. But we're almost entirely diamonds. If these were hearts, though? Oh, it's only played cards. Never mind. Yeah, it's not held in hand.
Anti 39. Wow. That's some ridiculous numbers at that point. There's our perfect combo. Okay, what is this next blind? Can we beat it without Troubadour? If we can't, we just re-roll through all $700. Oh, yeah, we can beat that. That's a one hand. Yeah, we'll do like two more re-rolls. We'll do that one. That's all we need. Why did it go down so much? That's fine. We can get through that. Oh, no, this is the previous one. Yeah, no. We won't know it until the next one. And we can no longer preview in the collection, I believe. Yeah, we can no longer preview. So it will be higher. So I think we have to reroll for Troubadour, right? There's no no reason for us to go play the next one, because we'll instantly lose. Because best we can do is a 2 to the 21 at the moment. So we just have to keep going. I think we're capped until we get hand size, yeah. <sighs> We just want Pluto and Troubadour at this point. We have our perfect tarot cards. We also want Temperance or Hermit. No reason to wheel. We hit in one hand for last round. True, but I think the next scale will be too big. That's only played cards. We are losing quite a bit of molt from boot, but I do think uh, boot hits after all of the kings anyway. That's so negligible at that point. Boot used to be important. Boot is no longer important. We ain't boot lickers. If boot hit, yeah, if boot hit before the kings, we're at like way higher, <laughs> way higher. But hand always goes before anything up here, I believe. Which makes sense, that you gotta have some kind of limit to this. I think we go down to like, I don't know what my actual money earning limit is right now. I think I need to have like a hundred something dollars. I think it's might be at 100 where my money is limited to. What does this guy do? Yeah, I think I... I think it's 100 right now is the lowest I can go to still keep my money income. I think I am if I get Troubadour. But I think Troubadour is the only chance. Maybe 80 with that Joker, yeah. Maybe. Yeah, without it, I don't clear. I agree. That's why I'm spending all of my money on this one. <sighs> Only played cards. Other Pluto. Yeah. No reason to use wheel. Temperance is good. Another, like, two, one shop roll at this point. Another Pluto. Again, man, if we... Oh, it's played cards. I keep thinking that, that would just be a crazy... seen a free range non-gmo negative we actually haven't which is pretty wild considering how many skips we've done all right i believe that's our last roll i mean i guess there's no reason for us to not go down to zero dollars because we're not making it through without troubadour no matter what we don't need money for interest anymore yeah they really are rare 
Brainstorm is good. I don't think I have Brainstorm unlocked yet. Uh, I know Brainstorm is crazy, though. Okay, we have... Our next shop reroll doesn't even give us enough money to buy anything, even if we see it. We could sell a useless Joker. Okay, we'll take 70 more dollars. Oh, I can't afford it. Give me my money back. Yeah. And a Pluto. One in a thousand? Sounds about right. All right. We did our best. Oh, yeah. No, we're not even close. Oh, my God. Went from 21 to 25. Well, let's play our final hands. Let's say goodbye. Yeah, we had no shot on this. That's crazy. Amazing run, though. Yeah, by far our best run. This run went insane. <sighs> Five Joker unlocks. Yeah. We just set up for a good thumbnail. Yeah, I'm going to put myself in after. Just do it a little flex thing at the end like we did last time. Um, but that's kind of the thumbnail there. Let me get my camera off of here. Uh, so I can take a better thumbnail and get the time thing off of it. Let me, uh, take this off and this off. Full screen preview. Cool. Uh, bring myself back here. Off this timer back. Let me open Photoshop real quick and just save that in my template. Easy edit for shorts. Yeah. Oh, if I play the final run here. Um, it's still pretty easy to edit my face into it. It's not too bad. Because the vertical is so limiting, you'd only see this tiny little middle portion anyway. Screenshot while it's flaming. I can grab that from the actual video at the end. Uh, but I, I wanted to clean... This is just for the thumbnail, the picture I just took. Uh, I'm opening Photoshop real quick. So I can save that layer on there. So I know what I'm doing tomorrow. When I work on the thumb. We could just make the thumbnail tonight. It's kind of fun. Thank you for the follow, uh, Kyo. This was our thumbnail from today. You didn't see it. I think it came out pretty good. The final had a little bit of sharpness applied to it. There's a little bit of blur here. Saw it? Yeah, I think the thumbnail was cool. My goodness, a 2K screenshot is pretty big. Okay, just so I have it for tomorrow. Save, and I can close that. Whoa, that's looking crazy. Oh, man. Oh, my computer is not happy. Ah. Okay. Are we back? Okay. <laughs> oh, that got real crazy looking. How many anti was beat? We completed anti-16. We made it to anti-17. Off runs cheat engine to get a sick blade run his computer freaks out. Yeah, that's what went down. Alright. 07 to the crazy build, boys. Let's say goodbye to it. It was a fun run. 
Oh seven, amazing one. Yo, Baz, thank you for the follow. Whoo! Crazy. This is like a victory lap at the end where we lose. We did get a lot of Pluto upgrades, but it's not going to be enough. If anything, we hit E22. Nah. 21. That's all we're hitting. I'm also losing Vampire Molt whenever I play these. I'm going to go up to uh, 4x speed here. These take a long time to go now. Oh, it's, just, it's like watching a titan perish. It's so sad. Yeah. Sad violin music for sure. Goodbye, man. Aaron! Stop! Yo, oh, Infinity, thank you for the 2,000 biddies! I appreciate you. Thank you for supporting the subathon. I told you it was going to get expensive if you tied those bit donations to the, the E levels. <laughs> thank you so much for the 2,000 bits, mate. Uh, Bryn, thank you for the follow as well. Bryn, Briv, Rivern. Second to last hand. Second to last hand. Oh, it hurts. I'm so sorry, man. I'm gonna miss you. Alright. Here's the real one. Here's the final final. time we're playing this one on 1x speed we completed 16 completed 16 here it is oh sevens give me a wall of oh sevens right now spam them as the final hand plays out goodbye deck you will be missed Possibly my greatest run ever. Oh man, this is like when you say goodbye to somebody and you both awkwardly walk the same way, but you're still trying to say goodbye. I shouldn't have put it on 1x speed. Oh, this is slow. <laughs> we might have 07, a little premature 07s there. This is going to take a while. Okay, okay, now we're there. Now we're there. Goodbye, deck. Goodbye. It's been real. Had a good one. <sighs> Best hand. 3.8 to the 21, boys. Woo! That was a beefy run right there. Anti-17. That was wild. Crazy actually insane. I'm not crying. 